bestowed so much wisdom upon you that you couldn't even fathom. God. So much understanding that you couldn't fathom. He was like, damn, when I was in Christianity, I was reading these same books and it did not say this, right? God. That's what you're going to say to yourself. It did God. not say this. I couldn't remember one precept when I was in Christianity, man. God. The most I put the spirit on me when I started to keep the commandments and now precepts flow through my mind throughout the day. God. If I hear something and I know it's off, the precept that, that, that the precept that tells me it's off goes right to my mind, man. God, God. You know what I'm saying? That's that's graciousness of the most high, man. That's that's him, that's him showing his wonders, man, because that's a wondrous thing, man. Because a lot of people look at the Bible as a puzzle, man. That's and right. it's made clear unto the people that's keeping the commandments, man. God. Right? Uh verse four, to whom coming as unto a living stone. Disallowed indeed of men, but chosen of Yahweh and precious, right? That living stone is Hamashiach, Yahweh Shah, man, right? And he was condemned of men, but to Yahweh he was precious, man, right? He also as lively stones, so we lively stones as well, right? Are built up a spiritual house, a holy priesthood to offer up. Spiritual sacrifices acceptable to Yahweh by Yahweh Shah Hamashiach. Wherefore, also it is contained in the scripture, Behold, I lay in Zion a chief cornerstone, elect, precious, and he that believeth on him shall not be confounded. So, when you believe on Yahweh, you shall not be confounded, man. This understanding, you got to truly believe on Yahweh, because that's why it says in John 7 and 38, uh, He that believe in me, as the scriptures has said, got out of his rivers will flow uh, living water. Man. Out of his belly will belly. flow living water, man. Right? So we got to believe in Yahweh Shah as the scriptures have said, man. Come on, come on. We can't believe in him as man has said, right? right? Man will teach you that he is so called white man with long stringy hair, right? Yeah, you gotta man, let will that teach, you. man will teach you that he loves everybody, man. Mm -hmm. And that's a stumbling block, man, because you won't even understand that he's coming to save your black ass, no, man. It, oh, man. Right? Come on. You won't understand what you being saved from. You come be on. broke down, downtrodden with diabetes and everything else, hollering you saved, man. Come on. That's nonsense, come right? On. So you'll be confounded, man. Brothers are getting the scriptures and confound you, man. God. But when you believe in your how as the scriptures have said, man, God. you will not be confounded, man. God. You'll have this understanding. You'll be able to go to the precepts. Hey, man, Matthew 15 and 24, I'm not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Mm -hmm. You'll be able to go to, to uh, Revelations 1 and 13. Hey, man, hair, hair like wool, uh, 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 feet like brass. Right? Mm -hmm. And be able to say a so-called black man. You'll be able to go to Luke 1 and 68 to figure out that we ain't been saved yet, but salvation is coming when we're saved from our enemies, man. Mm -hmm. Right? These precepts will flow onto you, man, when you when you believe in that chief cornerstone as the scriptures have said, man. Mm -hmm. Whatever you got. Right. Yeah, you know, like the brother kind of brought up, he said, uh, you know, knowing that Christ is the one who died for you. Look, this is, um, go, go ahead and continue where I was at. Uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 8 and verse 11. And through thy knowledge, shall the weak brother perish from uh from whom christ uh christ died right with all your old ways of thinking and your your defiled understanding all right and you're eating of because uh, you still just even what the scriptures say you're conscious uh it says for some with conscious of the idol you still have conscious un consciousness unto the idol is why you still hold on to these ways like you got some brothers and friends that still they they, they fellowship with the wicked man come the you got still you still got brothers and friends and that have understanding of the scriptures they still dwelling with the with the with the wicked because they have what they have uh uh the idol in their in their mind man they're bearing conscious of the idol right come so it says and through thy knowledge through the knowledge of the idol Shall the weak brother perish? Because there's brothers that come to this truth, they kind of weak. Come. You know what I mean? And you subverting the hearers, man. Come. Oh, the so-called man, you know, everybody gonna be saved. You know, so-called white man gonna be saved. The the uh, uh, Chinese man gonna be saved. Listen, they don't need the physician. Come. The so-called black man is the one who needs the physician. The so-called Native American who been murdered, killed off the land by the enemy, man. We're the ones who need the physician. So through your your understanding, your doctrine, your uh, uh, defiled knowledge, what does it say that you do? It says that uh, you caused the brother to perish from whom Christ died. And who is Christ? A so-called black man in the flesh. Okay? That's why when, when uh, you hear uh, 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 in movies where the uh, the wicked reveal themselves, they say in the flesh. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You know? As I live and breathe. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know? Hey, in the flesh, I wish I was a so-called black man. So you got to deal with that, man. Come. That he's the most hated. The so-called black man is the epicenter. Of, 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 of hate 
So-called black man is the epicenter of hate, man. Racial hate and racial tension, right? Mm. They hate us, man. Meaning the hate that the nations give to a certain people, the black man is the, is the epicenter of that thing. Mm. So it says, but when ye, when ye sin so against the brethren and whom their weak conscience, ye sin against Christ. When you sin against the brethren who's weak in their conscience, you sin against your house shop. Because you're telling him to go in a way that's not good. You're telling him to go in a way that does not profit you, right? His situation, right? Everybody haven't been receiving the understanding of the, of the scriptures, man. This is for only one people, man. No other nation can take this, these scriptures into their hand and know what to do with it, man. Only the so you see what they do and they 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 tell you that men can be with men and women can be with women. They tell you all these things that's that's off, man. Uh -huh. They tell you, you can eat pork. They tell you, you can eat the foul foods that that's actually getting you sick, man. That's actually murdering, killing your uh, killing you through their uh, philosophies, man. Uh -huh. Right. And it says, wherefore, if if meat make my brother to offend i will so yeah so this is that, that that's it on that you got anything come wait it's the book of romans chapter 3 verse 1 what advantage hath the jew or what profit is there for, of circumcision much every way chiefly because unto them were committed the oracles of yahweh exactly see so we got the oracles man you already had that you were already holding that yeah. Wow, that's crazy. That's the hey, that's the spirit right there. That gotta be the spirit. You know what I mean? Cause, cause, uh, cause, cause we got the oracles, man. We the only ones that. We the that, only ones that got the oracles. Exactly. It didn't say. It didn't say what advantage have the earth. Yeah. What advantage have have the, have the Asian man? Yeah. Say like what advantage have the, the Jew, Jew, man? Much every way. Much every way, Come man. On. Right. Chiefly because to us was given the oracles of Yahweh, man. Mm -hmm. Right. So you can't go to the so-called white man. And expect him to be able to break down the scriptures for you, man. Yeah. It's not given to him. What it look like, you know, me going to me. What it look like an Asian man coming to me talking about, hey, can you break down Buddha to me, man? <laughs> can you tell me what's going on with Buddha? Yeah. I don't have. I don't know. Yeah. I know you know. I gotta know all you these know things happening in the yeah. earth. Con. You don't see. You don't see the so called. <laughs> you don't see the so called Asian man going to the so called white man talking about tell me about Buddha. Con. You don't see the so called Ishmaelite going to the so called white man. Talking, can you can you tell me about? Can you tell me about Muhammad? Allah. <laughs> Come on. Can you tell me? No, only the so only the so-called black man will go to his oppressor and say, "Can you tell me about my God? Come on. Can you tell me about the God that looked just like me?" And what's what's so much folly about it is the so-called uh, uh uh I mean Jake will say, "Yeah, I know I know I know Christ is black," but then go right to the so-called white man and, and, and sit in his church. Come on. Go right to uh, uh right up the street. What it's called Lakewood Church mm -hmm. and sit in his church. It's us that fill that church up. Mm -hmm. Go right there and sit in his church and expect him to teach you about your God. That's folly, man. The scriptures tell you right now, right, right, plain, plain as day, that that we're given the oracles of God, man. Come. We're given this understanding, man. It's on. It's we're the light unto the Gentiles because we're supposed to teach them how to follow the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High God, not the other way around, man. Yep. And it's wickedness for us to think uh, that 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 we could go to our oppressors who we're supposed to be teaching how to follow the Most High God mm -hmm. and ask them to teach us, man. And that's going off, man. And they're gonna deal with it too. They're gonna get. They're gonna get that. Uh, that judgment for doing all that they done to us too. Huh? Verse verse three. For what if some did not believe? Shall their unbelief make the faith of Yahweh without effect? So what if they don't believe? What if they say, man, nah, the so-called black man, he, he can't, he can't, he ain't, he ain't the Jew. You know, he he can't, he don't have the oracles of God, man. Hey, the God, hey, y'all don't got the breakdown. Y'all don't got the truth. You know what you say? Yeah, nah. That ain't what Luke's ain't what Luke 1 and 60, Luke 1 and 68 is saying, man. It ain't saying that, man. Oh. Nah. Matthew 15 and 24 ain't saying he only came for Israel, man. You, you taking that out of context, man. What if some don't believe? Mm. Will it make the faith without God or none effect? Mm. Well, what it say? Let's see what it say. God forbid. Yeah, let God be true, but every man a liar, as it is written, thou mightest be justified in thy sins, and thou mightest overcome when thou art a judge. Oh. So, hey, yeah, how will forbid, man? This understanding is given unto us, and we got the truth, man. You understand what I'm saying? So when we say that the so-called white man got to go into captivity, got to go into captivity, man. Come. And it's gonna happen. It's gonna come to pass, man. Come. Cause let let Yahweh be true, and every man a liar, man. And the scriptures, this is what the scriptures say, right? That's right. Come on, that's what you know you got. All right. So yeah, man. And it says in uh, Micah chapter four. Verse one, but in the last days it shall come to pass that the mount, mountain of the house of 
of the Lord shall be established in the top of the mountains and it shall be exalted above the hills and people shall flow unto it. And many nations shall come and say, come and let us go up to the mountain of the Lord and to the house of the Lord, uh, Lord, the power of Jacob. And he will teach us his ways and we will walk in his paths for the law shall go forth of Zion and the word of the Lord from Jerusalem. And he shall judge among many people and rebuke strong nations afar off. And they shall beat their swords into plowshares and their spears into pruning hooks. Nations shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. See, under the so-called white man, we learned all that war. But these, this is what the brother's brother was referring to, man. This is what's going to happen in the land, man. Okay, we're going to receive, we're going to be lifted up again, man. The Lord going to bind us up, and He's going to bring us the former rain and the latter rain, man. We only going to know uh, peace, but we also going to beat these nations down to where they will be humble. We'll mm. humble them, and they're going to have to beat their their their, their instruments of war into uh, 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 instruments of serving. Mm. They're going to have to serve us, man. That's what's going to happen in the last days, and that's what the Bible says. So this is what we're trying to get these brothers, even the weak, even to the, the ones who have idols in their heart. We're trying to purge out those old things from you, man. Mm. All right, brother. You know you're Israelite? You didn't know you was Israelite, brother? Come hear the word. All right, brother, you might not have time, man. All right, so exactly, you know, that's what we're supposed to be. Understanding in these last days, man. We're supposed to. Nah. Israel. Yeah. Israel, man. We Israelites. No, right. we not. We not. We not Islam. We out the Bible. Straight out the Bible. The Israelites was black, brother. Jake, Jake don't have an understanding, man. But he knew what we doing. This is why we out here, man. He know we got some manner of knowledge. Huh. You see? And this is what we, that's what that purpose is for, man. And all these nations are going to humble down to this understanding. You got something? I got a scripture, but it's kind of just mind-blowing, though, because like the, the Jake probably about, you know, 17, 18, maybe, I say between 17 and 22 years old. Right. Right. And he was like, I just watched Malcolm X. I'm like, hold on, you oh, just yeah, watched yeah, Malcolm yeah, yeah, X? Yeah, yeah. That's a big one. That's <laughs> like, it came out like 1990 something. I, like, this is that's a shame though, cause that's something that that it take it take uh this whole Black Lives Matter movement mm -hmm. and Amazon to put them type of movies on the forefront mm -hmm. for our people to actually go look and inquire about these things. Oh, man. so the right man wrote it off? Okay, then I watch it. <laughs> exactly, what? man. Cool. It, it, that's what it take in order for us to, to go inquire about. He these put things, his signature man. on that. He put man. his his decree on that, that that we can watch it. When I was a youngster, even before I had this truth, man, oh, I yeah. still was inquiring about these things, man. Oh. I still wanted to know about the Black Panther Party. I still wanted to know about Malcolm X. I still wanted to know about all these different things, cause although you know Malcolm X taught Islam man he still he still was somebody that had a lot of knowledge man Come. he had a lot of knowledge man and I truly believe he he can he he came into some understanding before he died man cuz he was about to lead the nation of Islam man Come. right so so uh so hopefully yeah yeah you know what I'm saying so it's just kind of crazy that the young brother said I just watched that like like look young brother you should have been watched that you know what I'm saying I think I think she is a correct uh, yeah. uh you got, you got some? Yeah, I'm about to finish this right. out, and then I'm gonna go, go uh, let you go into that. So it's, it's, this is, this is what I'm talking about. That's the uh, uh, a firm understanding of brethren that's weak, man, weak in their understanding. So she can, hey, somebody, can, a demon can enter into him. Hey, hey uh -huh. what, how should I say? Don't enter this man again. See, these words keep keep these demons from entering to us again. When you broke it all the way down, you examining yourself in the faith through the scriptures. See if you be in the faith, okay. You breaking yourself down, you dying daily. And for those men, those spirits don't come back into us, man. Uh -huh. The spirits of unbelief, the spirits of 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 of, of, uh, of uh, believing in the in the idols, man, having these idols in our hearts, man. Those 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 evil spirits, the, the spirits that that uh, uh, to eat pork, uh -huh. right? The spirits to want to uh, uh, break the law, statutes, and commandments. The spirits that make us want to sit up here and and, and and murder our brother, right? Uh -huh. Hate our own people. Those spirits don't enter into us again because the with the washing of the word, man. And these are the these, and like the brother went into, these are the words that the other nations they're gonna bow down and hear these things, man. Uh. They're gonna have to. 
Uh. You know what I mean? Or there ain't gonna be no shirt dweller place for them. Uh. You see? So go ahead, brother. It's the book of Revelation, chapter 2, verse 25. But that which you have already hold fast till I come. That's right. Right? So that which we have, man, we gotta hold fast until your how shall I come, man. Right? We, we, we gotta hold on to these things, man. Hold on to what we got. That's the brethren right there. Hey, O.C. He just texted uh, me. Hey, and that's Chris right there. Look. He asked because he just texted me and asked me if we was over here. Oh, that's why. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. So that's Chris, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the officer asked. You know what I'm saying? Then that's the spirit. Then. Huh? Hold fast till I come, and he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end, mm -hmm. to him will I give power over the nations, and he shall rule them with a rod of iron, come. as the vessels of a potter shall he shall be broken to the shivers. Even as I received of my father. So the most high, the most over your house is telling you, man, hold fast till I come, man. And he that overcome, because we're gonna have to overcome. He that overcome the tribulations, hey, he's gonna give us power over the nations, man. And we shall rule them mm -hmm. with the with, with, with a rod of iron, man. God. Right? So we're gonna rule over these nations, man. God. Ain't no if ands, buts in between. Shalom. 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 Long time no see, brother. <laughs> Y'all yeah. brothers about to set up camp? Yeah, man. Come, come, come. Come, yeah. Oh, yeah, all praises. We're, we're all praises. Good to meet you in person, bro. Yeah, we're, we're wondering if uh, that's the whole camp with Oh, y'all, hey, we've we been out here for a minute, but yeah, y'all can jump in. I'll be a show you, man. I'm out here about shooting me out with trouble. I didn't say young man. Oh, I thought you did. <laughs> nah, how you doing, buddy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, we usually be posted up right over there. Oh, yeah? Um, It's a little section right in front of, like, the museum is across the street from us. There's a little section over there. 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 Today we haven't really gotten any uh any traffic.